I wrecked you. Uh, it's comics and shots. A completely improvised semi comedic musing by Howard Stern's Mick the Nerd, aka YouTube and TikTok's Mick the Man, aka Mick the Maverick, aka a guy who rejects one item shop and pay orders on principle. What allows your life to order and pay for one item from a grocery store? This isn't a restaurant. You can't do that. Well, you, sh you can, but you shouldn't. Today's subject, Absolute Power. The latest DC summer event, which I just finished. Summer and fall, actually. Summer, early fall. Yeah. Okay, non-spoiler stuff right now. Oh, man. So crazy. It's like... Waller had them by the ropes almost every single friggin' time. You know, you honestly thought sometimes that they wouldn't make it out of this. Because Waller has been upping herself in power for literal decades, and it seems like she has all the cards. So it makes it that much better seeing the heroes fight back to gain back what's theirs. For truth, justice, and the Latverian way. Wait, that's not right. Who cares? John, uh, John Kent, he goes through it. He goes through it in this. Yeah, oh boy. Am I kidding? They all go through it. Dreamer, oh boy. Yeah. Everybody goes through it. Yeah. Green Arrow? Mmm. Verging on spoiler territory now. Spoilers in 10, 9, 8, 7, 6. I really recommend it. Get the trade paperback when you can. We don't want spoilers. Five, four, three, two, one. Okay, so the entire time Green Arrow was working for Waller, and it seemed like he like he was brainwashed or something, like he actually believed what she was doing. He went double agent in the best way possible, had Martian Manhunter brainwash him into actually believing that even um, Waller's like, you know beliefs it was brilliant until the last minute when he like became himself again damn self brainwashing that is so metal granted he probably should have told the other members of the justice league about this but oh wait the justice league disbanded and left the titans in charge of everything and no diss towards the titans to which even the book even m mentions this they're great there should be more than just one freaking superhero team like the, the Titans were admittedly scaled down from what the Justice League were doing. And that, they had a lot of stuff, too. They're competent superheroes, but... Yeah, you're gonna need more than one international superhero team. You need this Justice League back. And it looks like we're getting it back, thankfully. Ugh. Just unionize all the heroes everywhere, otherwise you're gonna get another Waller situation. Ooh. But let's talk about the thing that is mega spoilers. I really recommend buying the book, turn off this vlog. You wanna get spoiled? Okay. Dreamer punches Amanda Waller in the face and then mind wipes her of every single secret she knows about every single superhero, but not the memory that she knew the secrets of all the superheroes. Just kept it on the tip of her goddamn psychic tongue. As the ultimate fuck you to Waller for all her grandiose moral speeches and everything. And my god, once again, spoilers, it's really good. Amanda says, you wiped my memories? Oh, I, I didn't just wipe your, mem your memories in your mind. I might have left something there. And Amanda's like, you, you put a bomb in my brain? How dare you! It's the absolute hypocrisy of it all. It's like, uh, all these decades of Amanda like just giving these grandiose moral speeches while doing the most horrible atrocities to the point where she became a caricature of what she once was. To see her finally lose and, you know, even give a straight up villain rant at the end that they broadcast to the world, it's it's amazing. That part was admittedly a little cliche, but it's comic books, you know? Yeah. 
Highly recommend it. It's a great story that talks about the dangers of fake news, the dangers of AI overtaking like human talent and everything. It's just a really good event. Probably just get the main... You can probably just get the main story. Maybe get the tie-ins if you like it. It's just, it and honestly, it's an event that actually says something, you know? Gangland, what the hell was that about? Web of Shadows? No idea. Wait, what? That's a video game. Dark Web? Uh-uh. Absolute Power was an absolute delight. I know it's it got a mixed reaction, but I really like it, and I really recommend it. With that... Like, like, comment, and subscribe. Donate if you're feeling nice. Share it with a bear. And always remember, praise be to the blood elk, fear the stab eponymous, and death to Kronos. <coughs> I had an eggplant for dinner. Well, half of one. Have a night, folks.